Richmond has a long history with flooding on the James River, but some floods are much worse than others. Here's what the numbers and descriptions mean when there's a flood warning. Minor flooding is defined as a 12-foot stage at the West Ham Gauge near Huguenot Road, or 8 feet at Great Shiplock Park east of downtown, which is called City Locks by the National Weather Service. A minor flood typically happens a few times per year, but sometimes there can be several. A minor flood mostly affects undeveloped land or the recreational areas along the riverbank, with little or no threat to property. Moderate flooding begins with a 15-foot stage at West Ham or 19 feet at City Locks. This kind of flooding happens less often, but is still to be expected several times per decade at West Ham. And sometimes we've seen several moderate floods in the same year, like in 2018. Due to a higher threshold at City Locks, it's less common there, and the most recent moderate flood was in 1996. Moderate floods start to affect vulnerable roads, railroads, and infrastructure near the banks, but the river still isn't threatening most developed areas. Major flooding is defined as 22 feet at West Ham or 28 feet at City Locks. This kind of flood is rare and last happened in November 1985. Richmond's flood wall wasn't finished until 1994, so it hasn't seen a major flood yet. For unprotected parts of the floodplain, a major flood will threaten homes and businesses. The modern records were set by Hurricane Agnes in June 1972. At West Ham, 28.62 feet and at City Locks, 36.5 feet. No matter the level, it's dangerous to be on the river during a flood or be standing too close to the edge, and never drive around a barricade to go through the water. It's impossible to know where roads may be washed out or filled with dangerous debris.